You're a cute boy, yes you are. Before we get on to the video, you guys, did you guys know that our family is running a giveaway um, until the end of the month of July? Cause we are. So here's what it is. It's for a gold iPhone 11 Pro. Awesome, everybody needs an iPhone 11 in their life. And a Brookstone wireless projector. So it's a super cool giveaway. You guys are all gonna love these entry or these items if you win. But it's super easy to enter. You have to be 18 and over or have your parents' permission and it is open internationally. You can find out all of the rest of the information by clicking the link in the description box below and back to the video. Good morning, everyone. Today I had to wake up pretty early around 6.45 because I had to prep Brady. Brady's going in to have surgery. He has, I'm trying to remember the name of it, but on little dogs, sometimes the patella and the tendon that attaches to it slides out of the groove and it can be very painful for little dogs. Well, Brady has it on both knees and they cannot do the surgery all at once. They have to do it one knee at a time. So I took him in this morning. He was pretty nervous about it. He didn't know why. He, I think he thought he was gonna be left again because we just got back from the lake house vacation. Um, but he has no idea he's gonna get surgery. He's eight years old and so I worry a little bit about him, but I'll update you throughout the day. Okay, so we just got Brady back from the vet. Hey buddy, he's got the cone. It's not a cone of shame this time. There just to keep him from nipping at his feet. See, he had, he had his little, his little uh, incision right there to correct the patella issue that he was having on his knee. Oh, he's kind of half asleep. He's oh, but he was happy to see us. We just gotta give him lots of rest, and he has to be in a place of the house that's quiet. It's like, <laughs> yeah, right. That's not gonna <laughs> that's happen. Not happen. <laughs> so today is Rylan's first day at work. She got a job. Excited? Yeah. Are you struggling there with your ear band on your? Yeah, it was like sticking straight mask. out. On the, see. <laughs> we just sold a bunch of those face masks on the website. We sold out in four minutes. Crazy, huh? That is crazy. Excited? I'm super excited. Yeah. But I know some of the girls that work here, so mm -hmm. it'll be fun. One of them was our neighbor in our last neighborhood here. Yeah. Yeah, so we know super her family sweet. really well. You go, girl. I'm so proud. Love you. Remember who you are and what you stand for. She said, Dad, don't film me. But <laughs> I just had to do it. <laughs> Okay, so I kind of look crazy right now because I was about to go wash my face and go to bed, but I forgot to tell you guys about my job. So basically, I got I got a job and I'm working at like a snow cone place. Well, in 3D and all that stuff, but mostly snow cones. And we sat down with the, the like manager of the actual store and he kind of walked us through like everything. It was just me and another girl that just got hired literally like the handbook like you walk us through the handbook and then give us a quick tour and then tomorrow is our first shift where like we'll be learning about like how to make them and what to do in this recipe i get paid by the hour i guess i mean that's something important there's not like positions so i mean there's like levels and there's obviously like manager but after that it's just kind of like you make the snow cones and you fill orders <laughs> they're just not like a certain person that's on the cashier i don't think you just kind of start wherever you're comfortable. I guess I'll update y'all further on if anything happens, but for now, I need to study the recipes. <laughs> I have a test <laughs> on the recipes, so better get down to the memorization on that. But yeah. Hi guys, it's Paisley Daxton and my poppy, dad. Um, so we are going to the orthodontist to see if we get braces, how long it's going to take to get braces. If you guys have braces, comment down below, because that would be fun to know. So I am actually nervous. Are you? Why are you nervous? I'm not really why, actually. All right, kitties, you guys ready? Let's go. I'm not that nervous. Let's go. Okay, so we just got done at the ortho, right? How did it go? Fine. Oh, you, did they give you some stuff? What'd they give you? A shirt. A shirt? What is that? Texas on it? It says Crossley Orthodontics? Mm -hmm. Yeah, Aaron Crossley and his wife Janine are actually friends of ours. She's an Instagrammer and a blogger. You can check her out. Uh-huh. And Aaron has his own practice here. Bag. Yeah. Oh, and it has a little pocket there. And so what did they tell you about your brace potential for braces? Daxton, what they tell you? I might need some. Yeah, but they're gonna have to wait how long, probably? Uh, about nine months to check on them, huh? 
Daxton yeah. has a cavity and I don't. Yeah, he has a cavity that we're gonna have to take in, huh? Gotta brush a little better. Paisley, what about you? What'd they say about you embraces? Uh, they said I have a frostbite. A little bit, a little bit, but you have lots of room. But your teeth are coming in just fine. So I would have to have that rubber band problem. Yeah, if and when you have braces, which will be when you're a little bit older, they might have to do some rubber bands, huh? They're all good. Mindy will be happy to know. I got them to their appointments on time. Mindy's at a uh, work uh, meeting today, so she couldn't be here, so I'm running all the errands. How am I doing? Boring. <laughs> Boring? Oh, I guess I won't stop at the ice cream store on the way home. No! Mm -hmm. Change that right now. Yeah, we have a flat tire. Do I remember how to change a tire? I remember parts of it. Luckily, YouTube exists and also parents, and I have a spare. Great! Also, I we literally just changed our tires. Like, not even kidding you. Like, literally just barely changed our tires like a week ago. So, okay, so we found where the jack and the, the, I'm gonna sound like an idiot. What is it called? Crank is. The thing is, is I am like wholeheartedly a big advocate for being prepared for stuff like this. And in no way, shape or form do I think I am not capable of it. I've been through several tutorials, but I wanna make sure 100% that I'm doing it right, which is why I'm gonna call someone else to make sure before I just totally botch it. But guys, this happens in real life. And girls, it's really important to know how to do this because there's not always gonna be someone there to help you. So, yeah. Our spare is off now. And got it all jacked up and ready to put back on. This has been a very interesting experience. I highly really recommend hot. everyone really actually hot. remove a tire. I have seen millions of videos and thought I was prepared. I was not prepared. Was right. So after sweating literal buckets, literally. we have successfully managed to put the tire on. Thank you to the Good Samaritan. He was extremely helpful. This is a good learning lesson. Just watching YouTube videos of how to change tires is not at all the same thing. No, it was even a process. Mildly, it was a process. Even trying to find <clears throat> where the jack was, I'm like shaking because I'm so hot. It's literally so hot outside. Even trying to find where the jack was or anything like that in your specific car, like make sure you know where that is. Make sure you know if you have a tire lock. Make sure you know, eh, blah, blah, blah. You have something that can pump up your tire pressure yeah. if you need it. All of that because I used it all and I thought I knew and I did not know. And so now I'm aware and I will always forevermore stop to help someone change their tire because that man was super helpful. Learning lesson to everyone. Also really hot and I can't wait to go drink some water. So. Yeah. Very hot. Hey dad, can I mend this? It has a hole and I'm gonna add more stuffing. It has a hole and the stuffing keeps them from me out. Bed. Is that what Finn did? Finn tore it open? Probably. So you're gonna do, you wanna do what? Mend it. You wanna mend it? How do you mend it? So it, that, see, that's the hole. Yeah. All I have to do is take thread and sew it But there. it's missing stuffing. Yeah, and we have stuffing upstairs. I have, I have it in my room right now because I use it to um, sew and make things out of it. You're gonna really mend that for me? Come show me when it's done. That's really cool. She's gonna mend that for me. See? So Brady can have it. What? <laughs> Come in. What is this? I'm joking, it's not a hat. Did you mend it? Yep. Let's see, what did you have to do? Can you tell where the stitches? I can't stitches? tell where the hole is or the stitches. Where is it? <laughs> I have no clue. I have no clue. Where'd they go? I think it's over here somewhere. There's gotta be a Are you playing around. a trick on me? I think you went to the store and bought a new one. No. No? So what did you have to do? I had to take a needle, first stuff it. Stuff it. Take a needle and thread. Well, actually, rewind, rewind. First, I had to get the tools. Yeah. Then stuff it. Stuff it. Then I had to take, you get the needle and thread, sew it up. Yeah. Tie a knot at the end. Uh -huh. and then start sewing. Had, I had someone else tie a knot so I don't, um, don't make any mistakes on the knot. Uh -huh. And then fully done. Then I. Is that the mattress part? To put on the mattress okay, part. Okay, put it in. The ash is in love with. Yeah, he was having fun with it, wasn't he? 
Yeah. All right, let's see, buddy. How is that? You like your little bed that Paisley fixed for you? Since Finn tore it apart, huh? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, look at that face. Her. Hope we can take that cone off soon. He is so cute, huh, Brady? He's my cute boy. He's my He's cute boy. boy. Yes, you are. Yes, you are. What do you say? Say thank you, Paisley. Thank you, sweetie. Nice work. <laughs>